Hello. Today I would like to introduce the operating system of our digital sensor RXS1000. So let's begin. First, you open up the application. And then you enter the password. Correct. And then when entering the system, you have to type the patient ID. Press OK. OK. Then plug in your digital sensor and then press the connect button. OK, so it shows that it connected. And when connected, it will show here a countdown to sleep. And it's 20 seconds. When the time goes to zero, you have to wait eight seconds for it to go in the sleep mode. And then when it's in sleep mode, it will prevent the sensor from heating. Okay, so now it's in sleep mode. If you want to capture, you have to press the connect button again. So press it. Okay, and it's connected. So now let's take a picture. Okay, so the picture you took will show on the screen. And if you press finish capture, the sensor will immediately counting down to zero and you have to wait eight seconds for it to go to sleep mode. So now it's in sleep mode you can open the pictures you captured here. So when entering, it will show the pictures of the same ID patient that you took. And because we only took one picture, so it only shows this picture. Then press the edit button to edit the picture. For here, you have the rotate button for you to rotate every 90 degrees each time and the negative button to make it negative and undo the negative and then the right side there's the contrast for you to adjust and then there's the brightness for you to adjust also there's the measure button for you to t press it and you can set a dot and then you can pull it to the place where you want to measure and press it again. Okay, and you can save this line in the image. And the yellow text, it will measure the distance for you. And if you want to adjust the length, you just press the line again, and then you can pull it to adjust the distance and the text will adjust it for you as well. After measuring, press the text button to enter the text that you want to show in this image. Press yes, and you can edit the text. You can zoom in and zoom out, and then if you want to edit what you type, you can just left, it, left click it twice or you can just press the type button. Okay, and you can change it. Press OK. And if you want to delete what you just did, you can click it and press the delete button. Or if you want to undo all of the editing, you can press the undo all button. And it will go back to the origin captured form and when finished editing you can press save to save it or if you undo all you can press edit again to go back to the pictures you've captured and if you want to delete this picture you can press the window and delete current image and then you can delete this image and after you're done press open again 
to go back to the capturing screen. So here, if you want to take another shot, you can press the connect button again. And if not, you can just close the app. So it's pretty much all of the instructions of the operating system. I hope you understand more about it after watching this video. Please give us a like if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any interest or questions, you can go to our website www.rolands.com.tw or give us a phone call or email. Thanks for your watching. See you next time.